Hey everyone, it's Elliot, and welcome back to the channel. So for the people that love cliches, history repeats itself, which is what happened this week when I made this preset. Pre-Fractal FM3, I had the AX8, and I cycled through just about every amp in there. Um, and for clean, I would often favor Fender amps. Fender amps. One of the favorites was the Band Commander, which is modeled after a Fender Band Master, and the Vibrato Verb, which is modeled after a Vibroverb. A specific vibroverb that was modded for Stevie Ray Vaughan. So a model of a modded, both of which I use in this preset. The bandmaster for more clean stuff, the vibroverb for like blues and like blues extra. After that I have my go-to favorite, the high power tweed twin, and in two settings. One that's like super blues or whatever, it's kind of like a huge pillow, and another one which is like a more standard distortion. I happen to like the like aggressive humongous pillow sound for single notes as they're just like but I understand if you want to play more chords or any kind of a third or something like that a chord that's not a power chord why you would go with the more standard distortion. Also it just fits in distorted sections better obviously. To be fair though drives two three and four in this preset are basically different flavors of pillow from like a darker heavier pillow to a lighter, brighter pillow. The first drive in the drive block is just for the normal distortion. I designed this preset with cover bands in mind in the sense of like, yeah, like I could have more specific sounds, but if you are just playing a song and you're just immediately into the next one, immediately into the next one, you just kind of need like clean or a little bit clean and then distortion or <laughs> a little less distorted. Honestly, also just like clean with a little bit of stuff on it and distortion would even just do. The band I built this for, for instance, does mainly medleys with in-ears. So I'm playing like 90 seconds of a song and then it's like, next song, one, two, three, four, you know. And uh, so I gotta switch quick. And sometimes the tones in those songs and flavors of distortion have nothing to do with each other. So a lot of personalization of the tones kind of goes out the window. That being said, it gives the opportunity to like dial in universal sounds, like a distortion that just sounds good kind of a thing, or a clean that just sounds good, isn't like, ooh, well it's a clean that works with this kind of guitar, you know, it just, it'll just work. Basically I needed a preset that just worked. So especially if you happen to play in one of those bands, give it a shot, link is in the description. Uh, for now, free, all I ask is that you like, comment, subscribe, support the channel any way you can. So let's check out the cleans. They are built for like the middle and neck position, although the bridge sounds fine with it as well. <coughs> the neck and now onto the middle. Here's the bridge. So that clean was the bandmaster. Here's the vibroverb at like the regular blues setting. If you happen to have splitable humbuckers, it also happens to split pretty well. And here's the middle position.
And although it's not built for it, here's the bridge. <laughs> setting which is a bit darker and more distorted although it's still I think usable with the neck although it might make you know be more built for the bridge here's the neck <laughs> extra with one of the three available drives see if you can guess which one and again this one is more for single notes and power chords not much else I do happen to really enjoy it for single notes though it does have that big fat pillow tone <laughs> rock which is again a more standard distortion <laughs> preset with five sounds that I happen to enjoy and I hope you enjoy as well. Thanks very much for watching and thanks for dropping by the channel where we're excited about guitar.